hello ladies and gentlemen, so welcome to a new shout out nail for Bart and Tricks! Yay! See you after my intro! Hello everybody, and welcome again to a new do it yourself at home and nail art! We are going to make the shout out nail today and we are going to make it for Bart and Tricks! So I have uh, tried to make his a little cartoon Toon people's Bart and Trick. You can see I have uh, some things that I have worked out and I think we are going to go for this one or for this one or a mix from this two because I like the hat also that Bart have on his head. I don't know if they are brother and sister or if they are a love couple so I want to make some hearts but <laughs> I, I don't know. Um, if I should do that. Uh, I don't get the chance to ask him that I was totally forgot it so uh, let's jump into the video and let's begin because let me tell you guys it's a lot of work. The first thing that we are going to do is uh, try and make this nail totally opaque white. So I gonna try to incorporate as much as she modern uh, pigments that I have because it's cartoony, so I want uh, I want beautiful colors in it. So I have laid out some pastel colors that I'm probably going to use. I have laid out the blue for the head from Bart, um, and I have the white ombre powder. So let me try to make a gel polish with this white ombre powder, and let's see if I can cover my a whole nail opaque white. Let's do it guys! So yes, I see out of the future here what I'm basically doing is I'm gonna tap 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 some of my ombre white in that little dish and mix it with some base coat. I know it is a big brush but it's only to paint it, it's not to put boulder gel on it on my nail off anyway. I think this brush is going to work fine for me, so let's do this. Oh, by the way, I did discover about uh, Bart and Trix, they are friends, yep baby! Whoa! Oh my god! She modern, you did it again girl! You did it again guys! You create again something! Oh my god, and this is only the first coat, guys. So imagine when I applied my second coat. It's almost opaque at this time. Oh my god. I have some white gels also, but let me tell you guys. Nothing like that. Really. All the white gels that I have in my collections are very see through the first coat. But look at that guys. Look at that and let me let me say you it I really am doing a very very thin coat. On my nail from this mixture, it's a very very thin, so uh, I can tell you I'm very very happy. So I have used the base gel. Let me tell you guys, it's also new for me to mix up some of the products. But oh my god, I hope you can see it the way I see it, guys. But oh my god. It looks amazing. It's not a runny at all. Look at that guys. Isn't she beautiful? So the only thing that I have you my white gradient ombre pigment and some base coat. Oh my god. So okay. I'm uh, I'm happy with it, so um, 
we're gonna cure it into my lamp and apply a second coat of my beautiful white. Oh my god, I still can't believe it. I'm so happy with this. This one is cured, so let's do the second coat, guys. Oh, a little a fun effect from Sassy from the future. Did you know, guys, that uh, this nail art is the very first one I did with the She Modern product? Uh -huh. And with that, I mean like my very first hand painted nail art. Okay? Oh my gosh, and let me tell you, I'm in love with it. I'm still in. My nail is cured, it's nice white. The next step that I'm going to do is give it a matte top coat. I'm going to use a brand new one like you can see. The brand CVKDR matte top coat. And it's a soak off gel. He's very shiny now. I hope you can see the shine in it. I know I still have to need I still have this top coat, but where is it? I need to look for it guys. <laughs> can you see it guys? I have no shine whatever. Okay, so uh, the next part I will explain it for you because I see from the past I was uh, not doing it for some reason. So I am drawing out Bart and Tricks on my thumbnail with a pencil. Easy peasy. Okay guys, I hope you can see my sketch. So, the next phase that I'm going to do is uh, look to uh, color in my two sweet peoples on my nails. Wish me luck guys! Okay guys, the first thing that I need to do is try and make some sort of skin color. So I'm gonna use this orange glow in the dark glitter and I hopefully can mix it with the opaque white I really hope you can see the color but uh, I think it's going to work I'm gonna mix a little bit more the way that I'm doing this here I have already have the base coat inside of it also I just gonna put a little bit of non wipe top gel also in the mix. Just a little drop for two reasons. On this way, I have a little bit more. And the second reason is that I'm hoping I don't going to have a sticky layer in my color. Look at the color, guys! Isn't it amazing? It's just like skin. So there we go, painting in the two faces from Bart and Tricks. By the way, do you know Bart and Tricks is an existing YouTube channel? I hope you can see the colors. I don't know if you can see it, guys. So I'm gonna cure it into my lamp and then you are going to see me back. All right, guys, it's nice cured up and I don't have a sticky layer, so happy for this. Let's begin with the blue. I have a light blue and a holographic teal blue. So uh, let's see what we can do with this. Like you can see, I am still using the white gel that I made with the white gel pigment, mixing it in with the blues. It is really, really easy to make your own gels with the she Modern pigments, guys. I really hope you can try it out, and especially because I mixed in the no wipe top coat, they are not sticky at all. So yeah, basically it's already top coated, so less work to do on the nail, and the nail is not becoming too bulky as well. So now I'm gonna mix the red glitter for the bow. Oh no, it's... Oh, okay, I was wrong. It's brown. Excuse me, it's a long time ago that I made that video. Okay, that's the rut. <laughs> so now we're gonna fill in her bow. Tricks her bow. Look how gorgeous. By the way, those type of figurines is typical for Bart and Tricks. They always draw it like that. I'm gonna use my calligraphy pen. Again, for this step, I know we have seen this already in another video from Urbex Lucan, I believe. 
so I can outline everything. So yeah, that is something that I do a lot on my channel. I like to incorporate like markers and stuff. It's really easy to outline, even to color in. So yeah, give it a chance. <laughs> Can you see how quick it goes? It's really amazing. Okay guys, we are almost done. I just need to top coat my work. And we are ready with the Bart and Tricks shout out nail. So, what do you think? Let me know below. Do you think I did a great job or do I do you think I did a crappy job? Let me know it also. I can tell you one thing. And that is, I have done my really, really best to make this a beautiful nail art. Shout out, nail! Ooh, look at the hello! Securing my top coat under this little lamp. And then we're gonna clean up and show the result to you guys. Okay guys, here am I. All ready and done. You can see part and tricks. On my thumb I really hope you like it don't forget to subscribe and stay sassy bye bye everyone see you next time